Hi guys! Today we're going to be looking at another vintage Bluebird Polly Pocket set from the Polyville range. This is the Treehouse playset from 1994. So this is one of the smaller playsets again. We've got two figures in it, which we'll be looking at in a minute, but first let's take a look at the outside of the set itself. So this is like a 3D set, taking the form of a tree on a grassy base. And um, we've got all these layers of different colored leaves, got a little bird in the tree here. On the base we've got a stream with a bridge across, leading up to a ladder going up into the treehouse. Um, we've got a picnic blanket, little flower detail there, and the stream runs from back here. And what I hadn't previously realised when I've been showing you Polly Pocket sets before is how these all link together with the pink brick road, not the yellow brick road, but the pink brick road of Polly Pocket. So you line up your houses and the road literally links up between so the, the dolls can move between sets. So let's open this up and take a look at the inside. So the top of the tree lifts up like this. We've got two dolls inside. As usual, we've got Polly, as you can see. This Polly is wearing orange with purple trousers. Sorry, the camera's taking forever to focus. <laughs> but I promise it is a Polly, even if the camera doesn't want to show it to us. And then we've got Lulu here, is in her, oh, the camera doesn't mind showing us Lulu. So she's in purple dungarees over a aqua shirt and she's wearing this purple cap. So then let's take a look at the inside of our treehouse playset. And you can see it's just set up like a really cool, fun treehouse for Polly and Lulu to play in. We've got a trap door here. It opens up into a secret slide, which comes out there. So the dolls go down there and slide out the bottom. Um, got a swing, which just swings back and forth here, which the dolls can sit in. You see it's like a, a seat on this side facing away from there. I think, yes, the chair swivels around. And we've got a lounger here. Not quite sure what this is. It's like a a chest or something where they keep all their stuff. A little table and chairs, so you've got a television, so yeah, they're really well equipped in this treehouse. And then the top half is presumably where they can sleep up there. So we've got a bed, we've got some cushions down here. Just really, really cute. And as usual, there's some there's some points on here where the dolls can comfortably stand so we've got one there where Polly can stand crossing the bridge take a look out at the stream obviously the dolls can fit into the swing you can just slip them in just knocked Polly off of the bridge I hope she didn't mind getting wet. I'm not quite sure how they're supposed to fit on this way. How is this supposed to go this way around? Yes, I think they're supposed to go like that then. It's quite strange because I'd be worried they're going to fall off, but no, I think they do stay on there. And it looks like Lulu's trying to hold her hand up to cling on to the swing. There's a couple of other little places inside where the dolls can sit, so we've got one there by a pair of binoculars so they can play lookout. Got one here. Various other places and there's even a place behind the tree. So I guess Lulu can stand there while Polly comes down the trapdoor and hopefully has more, more luck than Lulu not falling on the floor. She just comes straight down the slide and then she can go and play on the swing. I think 
they must be supposed to sit this way around. It's quite strange. I'm not. I'm not. Oh, hey, there you go. They do fit. That makes more sense. <laughs> I'm always a little bit worried about breaking these pollies, breaking their little waist joints. But yes, that's how they fit together. Got this little bird here, which I did wonder if that was somehow connected to the swing, but. I don't think the bird does anything, I think it's just a cute little additional feature. Then, and the uh, binoculars and the lounger and chair are outside, even when the tree is closed. So, Lulu can stand up here, and as I say, she can play lookout with her binoculars. And once Polly's finished on the on the swing, if I could get Lulu to stand up. <laughs> I give up. <laughs> I admit defeat. Lulu's just going to sit up here. She's not even going to sit up here, there she is. She's going to sit up there on the swiveling chair while Polly plays on the swing. So all in all, it's a really cute set. It's, um, as I say, it's one of the small sets. There's no, there are no battery operated features or lights or whatever. But I think I love the, I love the layers of the leaves on the tree. I love how the set opens up. I love the, I love the swing feature. Now I've worked out how to fit the dolls on there. I think it's nice that it's got layers, as in. Um, the dolls can be outside even when the tree is closed up. Um, yeah, overall I think it's a really, really sweet set and I'm quite sad to be letting this one go. But it's just sold on eBay, so... Goodbye to Lulu, Polly and the Treehouse play set. <laughs> so yeah, thanks for watching guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please do give us a thumbs up, comment below, subscribe to Skylark24 and tune in next Sunday at 10am for another toy review video. Bye!